We've already told you about two major road construction projects in South Dakota that will have a big impact on drivers. Crews have already started working on a diverging diamond interchange in Rapid City, and prep work has begun for one at 41st Street in Interstate 29. But as Kelloland's Don Jorgensen reports tonight, those two are just the beginning. Although you might find them confusing at first, you better get used to diverging diamond interchanges. The State Transportation Department says there are already two more in the works. The next one will be here at Benson Road over I-229. The reason? Increased traffic. And it actually has quite a bit of heavy traffic movement just because of the business corridor that it does supply, that people travel in order to go to work. You know, the Sanford and different businesses are right off of Benson Road there off of 229. Construction on that one will start next year. The state's fourth diverging diamond will be at the Brandon exit along Interstate 90. The need really arises from the heavy traffic movements during peak volume hours. Uh, there's a lot of traffic in the morning and in the evenings that enter and exit Brandon. And so that those traffic volumes actually warrant this type of interchange. Construction on that one will start in 2024. Safety is the main reason behind these diverging diamond interchanges because Johnston says they reduce the number of ways vehicles can collide by almost half. It reduces that conflict movement where traffic that's traveling doesn't have to turn left across lanes of traffic. Where you travel on the per se wrong side of the road or the opposite side as you typically do, you will be able to make a left turn movement freely without having to cross traffic. So it'll reduce that impact. Johnston says they should also reduce the amount of time you sit and wait at a stoplight. In Sioux Falls, Don Jorgensen, Kelloland News. But wait, they're possibly not done yet. Johnston says if the state puts an interchange at 85th and I-29 south of Sioux Falls, that one too will be a diverging diamond. We have a generally quiet day on the way tomorrow, but Tuesday and Wednesday we'll have a little more to talk about. Update.